That's a lot of berries. You're quite the gatherer, aren't you, little bast? Now go and see if you can find some more, hmm? Well done, that's a good boy. <laughs> Children. Come with me. She's an outcast to be shunned. There. Oh, come on. get through. This must be a ruin of the metal world. One of the old places. go in places like this. But I have to find a way out. shiny there. Lights everywhere. How does it do this? A metal door. Close. Maybe this device I found can help. 
do I get it open? More lights. It's connected to the door somehow. Changed color. Device. You think I want it this way? It's the best I can do. He's right behind you. Hi! <laughs> Happy birthday, Isaac. Daddy sure does love his little big man. Look, Daddy can't be there with you and Mom, but we can still have a party, right? <laughs> sure we can. <laughs> Show me. Show me again. I can do. Happy birthday, Isaac. Daddy sure does love his little big man. Look, Daddy can't be there with you and Mom, but we can still have a party, right? <laughs> sure we can. <laughs> last night? Well, we did. Kind of. Director Evans invited everyone to gather in the community room. Don't know where she got the party hats. That was a ghoulish touch. So there we sit, watching the clock tick down to midnight, and I'm thinking, 
Am I the only one who gets the symbolism of this? It might have been worth it if Skylar had gotten drunk again, but I seem to be a mistake she doesn't want to repeat. Lining up in the community room. Like cattle in a slaughterhouse, but smiling at each other. Sean and handing out meds like being alive is some kind of pain to be eased. Well, not me. I don't want to go quiet. I don't want to trail off. I want a period at the end of my life sentence, not an ellipsis. Hell, <laughs> an exclamation mark. So if that upsets whoever finds this, too bad. I don't know anyone, anything, anymore. Why did they die here? What happened to them? I mean, seriously? Record our thoughts for posterity? Great idea, Director Evans. Like, I haven't done enough for posterity already. Like, I wouldn't be here like this if not for posterity. I'm done with posterity. Posterity can go. Machu Picchu. Always wanted to see that. Never did. Why didn't I go with Owen when he asked? Stupid. Come, girl. Take my hand. You don't belong down there. Come! Uh. 
Such places are forbidden, Aloy. I fell in. They are of the metal world. What is that on your face? Nothing. Did you find it down there? No. Give it to me. No. Aloy, such things are dangerous. No! survive in the wild. Come, Aloy. Home now. But starting tomorrow, you will learn to hunt. muttering to that plaything. We descend to the valley now. Follow. The wilds can be dangerous, Aloy. You will need to stay close and do as I say. I know. Now. You're still scratched up from that fall you took yesterday. So let's start there. Take this medicine pouch. I'll show you how to fill it. See this plant over here? It's called salve brush. Come, gather its berries in your pouch. Good. Now eat the berries. They may taste bitter, but they can save your life. Always keep your pouch full of medicinal berries, flowers, and plants. Where are we? This valley is just a part of all my... Keeps out the most dangerous machines, usually. Further down river, we'll find a herd of machines, and I will teach you how to hunt. Are they dangerous? All machines are dangerous, Aloy. Their power must be respected. But I will be beside you. Mm. Aloy, a machine's coming. Crouch and follow me into the tall grass. Slower you move, the quieter you'll be. And 
crouched walking is quieter than upright. Wait for it. That's the last of them. Let's move on. You did well. They didn't see or hear you. Now stay close. That herd should be just ahead. and he is of the tribe. Maybe he doesn't like the tribe. Then he is a fool. Come now. Let's find that herd. Follow. See them? These are called striders. Ha! Get! Why'd you chase them off? Huh. To show you how some machines startle easily if they detect you and run away. They're best approached by stealth. Don't worry. We'll catch up with them further down the valley. You'll see. Now, I want you to find some rocks that fit the cup of your hand. Why? Do as I say, Aloy, and gather the rocks. I will show you how to use them. Those will do. Follow. Machines, right? No, but they can distract them, draw them into traps. Like that watcher over there. It must be dealt with, or it will warn the herd and send them running before we get in range. Warn them? How? The machines speak to each other, Aloy, unless they are first silenced. Now you stay here on the ridge. On my signal, throw rocks and draw the watcher over to me. Wait for my signal. Come, girl, it's safe now.
Harvest the kill so I can teach you how to make arrows. Good. Now, gather stalks of Ridgewood from the plants over there. Use the stalks as arrow shafts, and metal shards for arrow heads. Never run out of arrows if you know how to craft what you need. Let's put those arrows to use. Follow. Aloy, they heard you. Don't be so noisy this time. Let's put those arrows to use. Follow. It's time to make your first kill, Aloy. Strider. One of the weaker machines. But even a weak machine can kill a hunter if she's careless. She must study your brain. Its hide is thick, but there are spots where it is vulnerable. Lock its eye. And you guess another. The cat is still on its back. Is that a weakness? Yes. How did you guess that? The device. It showed me. But that plaything? Stop playing games. Now, take down that strider. Target the eye or the canister. And if it charges, be ready to roll out of the way. You did well today, but you have much to learn. Tomorrow, we train again. What was that? That boy. The one running the brave trails. Follow Eloy, quick!
need to do this slowly and quietly. Almost there. Wait. Oh, Mother, bless that girl. Bless you both. Boy! Save me. I, I just want to... Boy! Seal your lips. They are outcasts, both. And she is motherless. 
Come now. Back to Mother's heart. And you. That boy should not have spoken to us. It's against tribal law. We'll go home now. Follow. I know the way. Mother. She going to throw the rock anyway. Pilgrim, away to. from there. Back to picking berries. <sighs> You're bleeding. Let me have a look. Here, hold still. I'll get it. Why? Shh. Why am I an outcast? Aloy, this is not the time. Who was my mother? Aloy. I've told you before, that's not for us to know. You were just a newborn when the Matriarchs brought you to me. So the Matriarchs, they know? <sighs> it's not so simple. But they know. Aloy, we are outcasts. So how do I make them tell me? The Matriarchs? There is a way, perhaps. So tell me. It will be dangerous. How? It would take years of training. I don't care. How do I do it? Tell me. The proving. The tribe's rite of passage held every year. Those who pass become braves. But to the one who wins, the matriarchs grant a boon. A boon? Yes, whatever the winner wants. Then I'll do it. <laughs> whatever it takes. I'll win the proving. I see. We'd best get started then. Your training will be hard. And it'll take years. Start training? Yes. Follow. Fight now, it's Turtle Beach.
lost? Rost? Rost? Where is he? Two days before the proving and he goes off without me? He wouldn't do that. This way? It's the best I can do. He's right behind you. Hi! Skills? Skills? I have skills. Yay!
I'll find a use for you. He said we'd go hunting this morning. Why isn't he here? Where's he gone to? What's he doing up there? He's just standing there. What's going on with him? Did you want to be alone? No. We must speak. I've been thinking about your training, Aloy. You've learned to hunt, learned to survive. But I fear there's a lesson I failed to teach you. Would you learn it now? Of course. I'll always learn what you have to teach. There has been some trouble recently. It affords an opportunity to learn this lesson, but it will be dangerous. You must come prepared, or you will die. Or you will die. Descend into the embrace and oh, hunt until you've gathered Skywalker. the parts for fire arrows. You will die. Fire arrows? Fuck off. What kind of trouble are we talking about? Once you have the parts, you will meet me there, at the gate beyond the village of Mother's Heart. Uh, the North Gate? I am the embrace? my mind. Yes. your way. Right. There we go. I'm not putting it any louder than that. Right, there we go. Is that any better? Can you hear me? Is something else bothering you? No, I'm fine. Are you worrying about what happens after the proving? What happens is clear. You will be accepted as one of the tribe and I will still be an outcast. To be shunned. Rost, even if the tribe accepts me, I won't- There is much to do, Aloy. We will discuss this later. Anything else you want me to do while I'm down in the embrace? Oh, uh, Odd Grotto might be out of food by now. You could hunt a week's worth of meat for her, if you find the time. <sighs> Wouldn't mind if she'd say thanks just once. <sighs> Grotta follows the law. Her science towards us is honorable, not an insult. If you say so. Hello. I'll go gather the parts, but I'm also going to pay Karst a visit. Aloy, that man breaks the law every time he speaks to you. And I'm glad he does. 
I want to buy a trip caster, and no other trader will sell to outcasts. Stock it with ammunition, then. You'll find use for that weapon tonight. That sounds ominous. All right, see you at the North Gate. Michael, uh, not really. I haven't played for a very long time. Okay. That's in the opposite fucking direction. It's not what it is. This way. Whee! <sighs> fucking coup de gras. Dive into the embrace. Um, I learned is a PS4, not on, on Steam, mate. I'm just on PlayStation. That'll change after the proving. Two days. Two days until I get answers. Two days, and I'll know who she why was, and why I was cast out at birth. I have to look to be your bounty, All right. Hello, Grata. Oh, Mother, since I was cast out, have I not been constant as the river flows? Have I not kept the vows as the stones do? Show me your grace, oh, Mother, and provide for me once more. Don't worry, Grata. I'll hunt your rabbits. Right. Oh, shit. Right, is that oh, better? Can mother, everyone hear me now? Can I everyone hear actually hear me now? On the wind. I would count your blessings on my prayer beads, but I lost them atop the eastern overlook. My old bones are too worn to return. I, I, I'm so afraid if I turn it up anymore, I'm going to deafen everyone. Okay, we'll find you at your camp. That's a bad turkey, come back. I want you, Mr. Turkey. Fucking come back, you little prick.
Oh, it's there. Is it? Where is it? Oh, it's just me. Okay. I don't even care, mate. Okay, Grata said her prayer beads were at the Eastern Overlook. It's not far from here. Oh, there's a fucking watch on. Oh, fuck off. <laughs> the brave trail up the rocks is close by.
Yes, I went over right, you motherfucker. This way! Oh, I forgot Aloy can do this shit. Yeah, I forgot about this shit. Pissed off the robots. No! Oh, can have that, you prick. You can get off me. Oh shit, I've got to get all the way up there. How the fuck?
How the hell have I gone further away? It did. Oh, go away, you fuck! I'm just gonna go kill myself now. By the way, Gonzo, I hope you realise if I need any help, I need you to save me! Aha! Uh -huh. Got his prayer beads. I see why she comes up here to pray. It looks out to Mother's Gate. You know, well, I wonder what bothers me more. That she ignores me, or that with all her talking to all mothers, she's never lonely. Going down fast. And I'm getting the fuck out of here. Talk to an outcast? I'm desperate for help. Whatever the consequences. What's the problem then? Trouble with your leg? Forget about me. It's my daughter, Arana. She's in danger. She went after a scrapper near Mother's Cradle, and I fear for her life. I can't even stand up, let alone go after her. Will you help me find her? No! She's gonna die. Guide! You know the matriarchs might cast you out for speaking to me, don't you? I don't care. I tried looking for her myself and my leg gave out. Just find her. I'll accept any punishment if it means she's safe. Save me. Why would your daughter hunt a scrapper on her own? It's my fault. C can we not I argue on my feed, please, guys? Thank you. I barely got away. Much appreciated. I and held in the machine. That spear was made by Adina. My mate, who died last year. It means everything to Arana. She, she went after the scrapper to get it back. You said Arana went to Mother's Cradle? Yes, southeast of here. 
I forbid her from going, but ever since her mother died, she's become impossible. Damn it, look at me. A widower, now a cripple. Father that can't find his daughter. Please, help me set things right. I'll do what I can to help your daughter. Make sure she's all right. I'm begging you. I will sort you out, mister, once I've sorted out this old deer. Like, so much for me doing, like... But to be fair, this is why I like games like this. Easily off the, like, beat the track that. side missions. And especially a game like this, like... I know I haven't played it, but from what I make out, like, The Witch is the same. You can easily just get dragged off onto other stuff and... Spend forever doing nothing. Well, doing side missions, so... I like games like that. I do need to play Witcher. The snow's got a bite out here. I have only heard good things about Witcher, so... Three, obviously. What? It's all the way over the... You know what? I'm having you, sunshine. I'm actually gonna have you. All right. I think I just pissed it off. Oh yeah, oh yeah, fucking have that. Oh yeah. <laughs> Cause I would walk 500 miles and I would walk 500 more. I wouldn't. Get a taxi. Yeah, gone from um, what I make out. Just message him, you fool. I'm sure they'll like appreciate it. Hearing from you. All alone with All Mother, the only way she knows. Good news, Grata. Once again, All Mother has Pretty sure Panda and LSD would anyway. Cash would reply. Hitman, I haven't spoke to because he's been busy. I'm guessing he's All back at work mother. now, mates, but um Each morning I find your tears of joy speckling the leaves. See? Joy See Gonzo, the told you all you have made. See how I cry now with you in gratitude. So you'll cry for her, but you won't speak to me. Fine. Guess that makes you the better outcast. No, you're a cow! I may not be around much for a while. I'm gonna run in the proving, and... I'm not sure what's gonna happen after that. Oh, Mother. I thank you for the kindnesses you share. When the proving comes, in your great wisdom, may you give favor to a brave of generous heart. I think I get what you're saying. Goodbye, Grata. For now. Oh, Mother. Hear me as I count off my years of devotion from these beads. Let me whisper to you as your soothing whisper comes in the hushing of the grass.
Oh, mother. See how the beads have been worn smooth in the turning. When they were new, I prayed for my elders. But now they are old as I am. I pray for the young. Panda, don't be a bad influence. Even I'm letting him get on with his studying. And not inviting him to anything. You'll let us know though, Gonzo, won't you, mate? Stop sitting. Right, what was that? What the fuck was I doing next? No, I don't want to do that. I'm doing extra shit. Side quests! <laughs> Fucking side quests. This way! <laughs> Land on it! Way fucking! I did not think that was gonna work. I forget how overrun it is at pleasant times with these fucking creatures. I forgot how cool that slow mo was. <laughs> it's your sister, Olara! What, there's more people like fucking needing my help? Oh, for God's sake, hang on, love, hang on. Oh my good fucking God. Sounds like she's in trouble. Haven't noticed. 
saving me from those machines. Can I talk to you for a minute? You can in a minute. I just want to th thank you. I thought those watchers were going to tear me apart. Your father sent me after you. It's time to go home. I figured. But I can't go back until I get my mother's spear from that scrapper. That spear must mean a lot to you. Save me! Long before she died. I can't believe my father lost it. He didn't mean to. Scrappers are dangerous. I know. I just can't stand the idea that it might be gone forever. Your father is worried. He gets worried if I go ten steps to relieve myself, and he just... He doesn't want to lose you, Alana. I know, but... How did you wind up in that tree? I tracked the scrapper to Mother's cradle. Caught a glimpse of it, too, but then a... My oh, Mother, I'm just not a good enough hunter to get... You will? Go find your father. Oh, no. This trail ends here. Must be where she saw the scrapper. If I follow its tracks, I should be able to find that spear. Time to see Karst and get a tripcaster. Oh, useful. The trail ends here. I'll bet it crossed the river. Better check the other side.
Leader Gonzo. Yeah, I can. See. No, I thought that was one of the watchers up there then. Oh no, it's a scrapper. Even better. Another scrapper. What? Yeah, I do remember this bit. There. Time to get that spear. Justin, just about. Fuck it up. Diving about like a fucking loon. No, save me. Save these for the trail. Did I pick up the spear? No, I didn't pick up the spear. Where the fuck's the spear? Made weapon. Arana will be happy to have it back.
We no. So much for being careful. around looks safe to meet my guess is he'll be waiting for me there he is looks nervous Do you come from London? Under? Oh, we're in blue, I'm in London. Get your head, get your head to thunder. Well, 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 an outcast yeah, on my running. doorstep, all mother protect me. Surprised you saw me the way you keep looking every other direction to make sure no one's watching. Careful there, or you'll sprain your neck. It's always a pain <clears throat> in the neck when you show up, girl, one way or another. Ooh! Fucking Mandarin looking bitch. Is there a reason why you're acting so cranky today? Yeah, bitch! Once you run the proving and get made a brave, you'll deal with traitors in mother's heart. Maybe I don't like who. Traitors who don't break the law and deal with outcasts? That's right. Our days of crime will be behind us, so long as you keep. Last time I visited, you had a trip caster. I do. But you'd need to bring me a scrap. Scrapper land, of course. What can I say? Oh, I can pay. Took down a scrapper not long ago. I'll be the judge of that. Now they're all like, fuck you, rabbit. Am I being really stupid? I thought you wanted a trip caster. Oh, right. Yeah, okay, I'm shot. yourself a trip caster practice how to use it someplace my life's exciting enough without a bunch of shock wire booby traps really Could have... <laughs> will you be around later in case I'll be here same as usual bring me the parts you harvest from any machines you hunt the better be sure to take a close look at my inventory though who knows
Oh yeah, the fucking rope caster. Yeah, I do need a rope ca I do need a rope caster at some point. So. Another day. I guess that can. All right. I've got what I need. to meet Rost at the North Gate. Forgot how big that fucking map was. <clears throat> Oh, 
Oh, mother be praised. Aloy's back with the spear. First you send a Rana back to me, and now you've got the spear. When I first called out to you for help, I didn't even know if you'd speak to me. I'm glad you did. Me too. I can't believe you got the spear back. Your mother knew how to craft them. It's of exceptional make. I'll never be the crafter she was, but she did pass along a few tricks. I'd be happy to take a look at your spear. Thank you. It sounds like... She was special. I'm sorry for your loss. Well, because of you, I still have the spear to remember her by. You didn't have to help us, but you did. She would have admired that. Thank you, Aloy, for everything. And now we dance. Oh yeah. Right. Anyway. Um. <laughs> when I think what it would have been like if. Okay. Oh, look at my spirit. Oh, I think that's yeah. Right. Now what do I do? Save me. Uh. Ruins! Hey! I wonder what could be in this ruins. Ruins! Don't you wonder what could be in those other ruins? Shall so we go and have a look? I think this is way too early for me to go down here because I think I've got a lot of override change. I don't know. This is one. Hang on. Is it one of the override parts? I don't think there's anyone watching that like. Fuck it! Away we go! But if it, this is what I think it's it going to be robots around here somewhere. Alright, it's a foxy fox. Oh, is this the ruined Aloy Fair? Yes, it is. This old place. I haven't been here in years. Wonder what I can find. Yeah, I wonder what we can find Hey, boy. Look out below! Right, I only doubt I can get out of the way I just came in, but I'm gonna try. Yep. 
Go through, Aloy. Come on, good girl. Aloy, get him through there. Save me. didn't leave these. They're new growth. That area back there. I wonder if I can find a little bit of a little bit of Some kind of power cell. I wonder what it's for.
save this for later. calling out for do you need help i have nothing against outcasts far from it but i shouldn't talk to you i don't want to get in trouble i don't see anyone else around to help i guess you're right i'm sorry i, I didn't mean to be callous my brother was cast out but his sentence has ended he he should have come home but he didn't and and his camp was covered in blood you um you said your brother's camp was soaked with blood? The Braves went looking for him, and, and that's what they found. All I can think about is what might have happened. Is he really dead? Or maybe just wounded? Is he suffering? Does he need help? I can't stand it not knowing. What are you doing out here all alone? Each day I cut a notch on the wall so I knew Brahm's sentence was over. Then I cut three more, but he still hadn't come back. I begged the matriarchs to send braves to find him, and all they found was a blood-soaked camp. The braves said he must be dead, but I have to know the truth. Why was your brother cast out? Rom was always a little different, a little touched. One of the hunters had a cruel heart and never let him alone. I was gone but an hour, and the hunter said after him like always, but this time, Brahm struck back with a rock and split the man's skull. Spirits made him do it, he said. Whispers of the forgotten. It cost him ten years. I never should have left him alone. What do you mean, forgotten? All mother curses blasphemers who won't repent. Banishing them from her eternal memory. Those lost spirits are the forgotten. Brahm used to say they spoke to him, told him to do things. It was such a burden for him, and, and there was nothing I could do to help. I'll do what I can to find your brother. You will? Then let me come with you. I won't be a bother. I know how to stay out of sight. I'm faster on my own. If that is how it must be... Just find him then, please. Good. I can use this.
Yeah, so sorry about that. Yeah, my internet just went for a minute there, guys. Um, yeah, I'm back. Alright, let's go this way. Ah, oh, how many fucking watches? Alright, there's two watches up there. Shouldn't have gone in all guns blazing, should I? Right. Bombs camp. Better clear out those watchers. Ready or not. Blood, but no body. There's gotta be more to this. Looks like a few drops of blood lead away from the camp. So sorry about that. Yeah, it might. Whose knife is this? Did someone attack Brom with it? Looks like more blood leading away from here. Someone bring the blood to the camp? The trail of blood ends here. But whoever left it must have also left tracks. Get off me! Red light means trouble! Can't touch this. Ding, 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 ding.
not be too prepared. <sighs> Snow chill itches. If the blood from the camp came from this boar. If Brom did this, why does he want people to think he's dead? And why desecrate the shrine? Looks like he was a watcher. Where I'm following in the short run. If it's Rom, he definitely knows how to handle a spear. for a long time. Why take food and gear now? from the cash. Why would they take them and just throw them away? I will. I'll, I'll kill myself. I'll kill myself before I hurt her. <laughs> Listen! Ugh. 
I will. I'll, I'll kill myself. I'll kill myself before I hurt her. You, you're not a spirit. What do you want? I want you to step away from the edge bomb. No. Leave me alone. Can't you see I need time to think? I, how, how, how am I supposed to think when everybody is shouting at me? So many voices to listen to. You must make your head hurt. I promise my voice will be soft and soothing. A soft voice, like Alara's. It's been so long. Years. Yes. Yes, I... I will listen. That's better. Now tell me, what's troubling you? Spirits of the Forgotten. Souls cursed by the All-Mother. Their voices never let me be. They want me to do things. Hurt people. If I go back to the Nora, they might make me hurt Alara. And I... I'll kill myself before I let that happen. Do you have to listen to the spirits, bro? They're speaking to me right now. Always with me. They take care of me. Keep me company. Help me. Except when they scream. Like when that hunter knocked me down. Crush your skull with the rock, they said. And I did. Brom, you're alive. Oh, mother be praised. I'm sorry I followed you, but I had to make sure he was all right. No, 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 no. Please, sister, I, I, I can't protect you. I need no protection from you, Brom. He fears these spirits that he hears will turn him against you. Unless your voice can quiet them? Yes. Just as it was before. He only ever hurt someone once, and it was provoked. I... I don't want to hurt you. Brahm isn't ready to return to the Nora. But I don't think he'll hurt you, Alara. There's a place where I can stay. A cave on All Mother Mountain. I suppose you could visit me there? So long as I'm strong. You will be gone. I'll help you. Thank you, Aloy. I'll take care of him now. May you walk in all Mother's eternal memory. And may the Forgotten leave you be. You have the firearms. I do. Those explosions and shouts beyond the embrace. Is that the trouble you were talking about? You will know soon enough. Until then, we wait for dark. Wait for dark? I 
I don't understand. Those explosions are outside the embrace. The lesson will be taught in due time, Aloy. I got Odd Grata her rabbits, for which she thanked all... It was all Mother working through you to bring her the rep. You always say that, but I was there and I hunted a... And you always say that, and so make... Look, Lost. I've thought it through, and I'm not... I'm just... I won't do it. I'm not about to pretend that you never raised me. Aloy, the law forbids all contact. It does, and I don't care. I know what duty means for you, Lost, but all tribal law has ever done for me is take things away. And that's not gonna happen again. Aloy, I must obey the law. And so you will. I knew you'd say that, so this is what we'll do. I'll come to you in secret. No one will see me, so I won't get in trouble. A and I know you won't talk to me because it's against the law, but I'll talk to you. It'll be my crime, not yours. You'll just listen. And that's how we'll handle this. You've... put a lot of thought into this. I know. So you can stop worrying. It's handled. Yes. And so it is. I saw Karst and got that tripcaster I was talking about. I hate to think what that outlaw trader charged for a weapon of that make. It wasn't cheap, but the caster is worth it. Perhaps. You'll know it's worth soon enough. Still a while to go before dark. I guess I'll get some rest. Good idea. There'll be no time for sleep tonight. thirsty for rain. Me, not so much. Opening a gate for an outcast? Some who are shunned reaped honor before disgrace. <sighs> so much for tribal law. I spoke to no one, and now we must both keep silent, for we are outside of the embrace. These are the true wilds, Aloy. With threats unlike any you have ever faced. That carcass? What sort of beast was that? The tribe calls it a sawtooth, and it's something new, something angry. Since they first started appearing ten years ago, they have killed many braves. Yeah. Follow the path. It's not far. Gene, you're hunting now. Oh. I see. I'll watch your carcass. I'll harvest the parts. Watch your surroundings.
much farther now. Why are we the only ones out here tonight? Why can't the tribe's braves hunt this machine? They did. The kills we bastard theirs. And tomorrow, they will hunt again. They won't need to. This machine will be my kill. Or your death. You are not careful. How many were there? I didn't bring you here to answer questions, Aloy. I brought you here to deal with that. Yours to make, Aloy. Yours alone. No matter what happens, I will not intervene. You understand? You are on your own. I should stay out of sight. I can use the tall grass to approach. Okay, let's see. Where can I place my traps?
Why did I bring you here? Not to answer questions. Aloy. Survival requires perfection. It was a test to hone my skills against a dangerous new machine. No. Follow. These are Nora hunting lands. They must be protected. If you hadn't destroyed the Sawtooth, how many braves might it have killed or injured tomorrow? The lesson lives within the question, Aloy. For years, you've trained to win the Proving, but only for yourself. As a brave, it will be your... But I never said the tribe wouldn't need you. The strength to stand alone, Aloy, is the strength to make a stand. To serve a purpose greater than yourself. That is the lesson you must learn. And remember it. After the Proving. And after I'm gone. Don't leave me! Save me! We're finished here. Follow. Oh, shit. I think I've just remembered what happens to Rost. Dawn has passed. Save this will be your last day in the embrace as an outcast. Me. Use the time to set your mind on the challenges before you. When it is time for you to go to Mother's Heart, I'll be waiting for you along the way. I understand the final lesson, Rost. Do you? But if I'm going to stand for something, it'll have to be something I believe in. Then I hope you find it, Aloy. I hope you do. I'll go back to the cabin with you. I'm not heading there just yet. I have other plans. Oh. Such as? I'll be waiting for you when it is time. I'll see you at Mother's Heart, then. You will. What do I want? Do I want the silent drop? Oh, I've, actually, I can get both.
So, it's time. Are you ready? Oh, sorry, Michael. I, yes, I am ready. I was just quickly uh, getting myself a drink because I know I've got to settle down and do this. This is a good hour or so. Yes, I guess. It's louder than I expected. You've never been so close before. I guess everything's bigger up close. Soon it'll all seem familiar. Like home. I don't know about that. Look for High Matriarch Tirsa. She'll help you. Any other concerns? Any final lessons I'm before I head I'm concerned about no. my ginger hair. You've learned every lesson the Wilds have to teach. 
It produced you. It was you who taught me, not the wilds. Not sure my bow and spear will be much help in there, though. It is with bow and spear that you'll win what you've wanted all these years, Aloy. Answers. What should I expect once I'm inside? There will be people celebrating and feasting. More than you've ever seen in one place. No other village compares to Mother's Heart. It is the seat of the High Matriarchs. A center of Nora life. A jewel of the sacred land. Give it time. And you'll grow fond of it. As I was. Back when I was at the tribe. Are you sure they're gonna let me in? <laughs> I've told you, Aloy. By law, any child outcast can run in the Proving. And any who pass are made braves and are outcasts no more. I know that. But not everyone follows the law like you do, Rost. Have faith, Aloy. The tribe will honor your right. Are you sure they're gonna let- <laughs> I've told you, Aloy. By law, any child outcast can run in the Proving. And any who pass are made braves and are outcasts no more. I know that. But not everyone follows the law like you do, Rost. Have faith, Aloy. The tribe will honor your right. I'm ready to do this. See you back home in a few days? You will not find me there, Aloy. Here. Take this. To remember. Why are you talking like we'll never see each other again? No. No! You should be with the tribe. And I will always be an outcast. But I told you, I have that figured out. I'll come to you in secret. I'll be the one breaking the law, not you. You don't even have to talk to me. This attachment to me will only hold you back. It's my wish that you embrace the tribe. You've lived in isolation long enough. Not until now, I didn't. For your sake. I must go where you will never find me. This... This is goodbye. No. It's not. You taught me how to track. Wherever you go, I can follow. Not this time. This time. And every time. I'll be wearing this when I find you. May all mother bless you, Eloy. And you. First, the proving. After that, I'll see where his trail leads.
One sec, guys, I just need to check something. Sorry guys, again, bear with me. Sorry about that. Am I going this way? Run! Save me. You will turn back, outcast. No, I won't. Or bleed. I'm coming in, bitch. Your choice. Make way. Make way. Braves, stand aside. She is welcome here. Mother's heart is open to you, child. Come. Most Nora aren't so rude as those idiots. You're Tirsa? <laughs> yes. But for the moment, I must leave you. I have other outsiders to keep safe tonight. You what? Envoys from another tribe, the Karja. Come to observe the proving, and oh, how the Nora hate the Karja. Karja. But that's my problem. We will talk later. In the meantime, enjoy the festival. 
Oh, down the path to the right, you'll find an old friend who can't wait to see you. But I don't know anyone here. <laughs> Try telling him that. We will talk later. May the goddess protect. What is going on? Correctly? Are you the old friend Tirsa told me about? I don't know you. <laughs> I see you don't recognize me. Well, it was a long time ago. Teb is my name. You were half my size when you saved me from a herd of machines. I remember. You tried to thank me. I never forgot that day. All these years, I hoped to see you again, if you came to run in the Proving. As you can see, I didn't turn out to be much of a hunter. I served the tribe as a stitcher instead. A maker of garments and armor. In preparation for this day, I've made an outfit for you. I hope you like it. What's it going to cost? Cost? <laughs> Nothing. Consider the thanks I tried to give years ago. Long overdue. Do I actually want that? It's just that. Do I actually want this? I've got a sneaky fucking sneak. Why do I just keep what I've got? Can I just keep what I've got for the minute, guys? Yeah. Wait, Aloy, you didn't take the outfit I made you.
time. There. Try it on when. Uh, thank you, Tap. Well, it's yours. Every outfit offers some advantage. Anyway, I shouldn't keep you any longer. Head for the Matriarch's Lodge if you want to find Tirsa. You'll know it when you see it. A large wooden building with an angry mob waiting outside. Tirsa said something about envoys from another tribe? Yes, that's what the mob's angry about. Karja visiting our sacred land for the first time in years. I'd expect to see some tomatoes fly, maybe rocks. Hopefully not spears. In any case, be ready to duck. Three children? What's the Nordy three children for anyway? Sweet! You'll have to tell this when I'm gone. I In like this better the first three times I heard it. All life came from all mother. People, machines, and beasts, all were her children. They lived alongside each other in the comfort of her wild embrace. Is it just some? Is her still a bit off this year? Though they took of her bounty. I don't need a new friend. wanted more. These were the faithless. The machines had whispered to them, promised to serve them, to make them a new world, better than the one all mother provided. A world. The festival before my sister's proving had much better music. They told the faithless they would do all the work for them. The brew's Feed even them, better than last. Shelter that. them, give them a life of peace, and that's a feat of plenty. And so, the faithless left with the machines. Only the true children. The mothers and fathers of the Nora stayed with all mother. At first, the machines did as they had promised. They built cities, great and terrible, monuments to their sins. But they would not serve the faithless for long. A king rose up among the machines, a machine Such more talent. powerful than a gift any from all mother. other. The Terminator! The faithless served of him off the machines. Just look at it. That was not enough for the metal devil. He wanted all to serve him and tried to tempt the true children away from All Mother. They would not go. They gathered on the mountainside to cling to her and pray, more devoted than ever. The metal devil raged louder than thunder. In his fury, he came to confront All Mother, intending to kill her. She struck him down. Forever. As you know, for his lifeless body is up there still. We fell in love with him. Shame. And defeat. The machines were driven mad by the death of their king. 
Vas, Vas, Vas. What about Vala? She's the faithless of blood of a war chief in her. Forced to wander the world without the care of machines. I won't only Jenny remain the true children of all mother. We built all this with the hands that she gave us. Machines are to be hunted. Metal to be used for scrap, for craft, but never to be adored. And we stay true to her laws, resolute in our prayers, don't we? I heard he'll ask for a name. the dangers are never over. But not with his girl. Still, the faithless envy our sacred land Dad. and covet it. And year upon year, the machine's anger grows, searching for little more boys and girls who have not. Yeah, been I've heard better. What? Is that a machine among us now? No, no. These old eyes are mistaken. Of course, Bottoms. Just look at them. Listen carefully now. For you'll have to tell this when I'm gone. Aloy, over here. Karst? What are you doing here? Careful. Pretend like we've never met. I wasn't supposed to trade with outcasts in the wilds, remember? How could I forget? And how generous of you to talk to me now. Don't be like that. You know I'll be rooting for you in the Proving tomorrow. Can't wait to see the looks in some of these faces when you win. And if you need any last-minute supplies, uh, I'm your man. So? Well, a man can't drink alone all the time, can he? There. I won't hold it against <laughs> you. I'm joking, Karst. <laughs> all sail. Right then. Good luck, Tim. In a moment, we shall bless the proving. But first, we have guests to welcome. For two years, we have been at peace with Akarja. It is time to restore our bonds of trade with Meridian. These envoys come to us under a banner of peace. <coughs> An annunciation of gratitude Return to the hand slavers. of yeah. Sand King yeah. of Killers and Slavers! Hey, hey! Luminance of Hold your fruit, nor... Uh, nor a faithful. Hold your fruit. Now, I'm Azaran, not Karja. So I'll put it to you straight. The 13th Sun King was a murderous bung. Oh, he was. He was a tyrant and a monster. He raided my tribe for blood sacrifice, just like yours. My own sister was taken. I hated the Karja. But the 13th King is dead. Two years now. Who killed him? The 14th man. Yeah. Not because he, he lusted for power, but because someone had to put an end to his father's atrocities. Yeah! yeah! The message that this poor priest means to read is an apology. Straight from the lips of the 14th king. So please, can't you lend him your ears? Yeah, thank you. <clears throat> An enunciation of gratitude written by the hand of Sun King Avad. 
14th luminance of the Radiant Line. People of the Nora, on the eve of your proving, know that Karja stand with you as the sun frames the stunted tree. As those Just like mine. you have nurtured, take their places. You're the only other person I've ever seen wearing a focus. Where did you get yours? What? A Nora? Wearing one of these? That's impossible. Your tribe fears the old places. Forbids them. Who says I'm like other Nora? Why, uh, I guess you're not. If you've gone delving in the ruins of the metal world. What's wrong? Apologies. Uh, a malfunction. Oh, Lynn? You making friends with locals, are we? I'll... I'll come back. Wait! No. Uh, we'll talk later. Have to go. Whoa. Well, I guess he's more hungover than I thought. <laughs> hey. You got the same trinket that Olin has on his head. Since when did those become fashionable? His name is Olin? Who is he? And where did he get one of these? Ah, he's just a scrounger with friends in high places. Now, he spends half his time digging for artifacts, the other half drinking or dicing. As for the trinket, well, I guess he dug it up somewhere. Just a weird old jewel he sticks on his face. I mean, no offense, it looks great on you. I thought your friend was gonna go down in a hail of fruit, but you really calmed the crowd. Uh, thanks. I, I wasn't sure I could do it. The Nora is still pissed with the Karja about the Red Raids. And who can blame them? I've never seen armor like yours before. You've never seen Vanguard steel? Well, let me introduce you. Ring-locked, impact-protected, sturdy enough to choke a sawtooth. It has to be. The Vanguard of the Sun King's best. Life-takers and machine-breakers to a one. You might even give the Nora war maid like you more trouble than she can handle. <laughs> With all that metal to slow you down? I doubt it. Yeah, hard to say. From where I'm standing, looks like a pretty even match. What else do you know about Olin? Well, is he really that interesting? I'm starting to get jealous. Well, he scours the wilds for ruins, digs up stuff, and sells it to nobles. When he's not scrounging, he's scouting. Exactly the skills you want the man guiding your expedition to have. I've known him for a few years. He's a loyal companion, cares for his family, holds his drink well enough. I like him, but besides that, not much to tell. Tell me about Olin again. When he's not scrapping, I've... I wanted to ask you something. If you want, but... I never heard anything about Red Ray. Your tribe was at war and you didn't even know? Were you kept hidden away? Did you have overprotective parents or something? I grew up as an outcast, shunned by the tribe. Oh, yeah, I've heard the Nora do that. That seems cruel, if you ask me. But even an outcast knows about the derangement of the machines, right? How they get deadlier every year? Well, the mad Sun King figured if he spilled enough blood to the Sun God, it would calm the machines. Didn't work. But for years, he raided the tribes and took captives for sacrifice. My sister among them. The Nora put up a good fight, but lives were lost. Your sister was taken captive and sacrificed. <laughs> captive, yes. Sacrificed, no. It takes more than a few Karja to finish Ursa. She got away, and now she's my captain. Captain of the entire Vanguard, favored by the Sun King himself. How did she survive? Well, that's a story, all right, but it takes a while to tell. Maybe another time over a drink or three? Or just come to Meridian and meet her yourself. I think you'd like each other. You're both rather, uh, direct. 
So what happened? How did it all end? The Mad King's own son united Karja rebels with Asaram freebooters. And together we did the impossible, took back Meridian and killed the crazy old king. So now the sun sits on the throne and it's a big improvement. Under Avad, there's no more sacrifices, no more slavery. People from all tribes are welcome in Meridian now, even Nora exiles. You really should... You said the machines have been getting more dangerous every year. Yeah, I don't have to tell you that, right? First I've heard of it. Oh, I'm sorry, I just assumed everyone knew. Well, the way I hear it, 15, 20 years ago, the machines weren't always pissed off like they are now. When a hunter came at them, they'd spook and run. So it was hard to take them down, but not dangerous, so long as he was smart enough to jump out of the way. But then the derangement starts up and everything changes. Now, when a hunter fires a shot, the machines snarl and charge right at him. A few more years pass, and they start attacking people on sight. Going anywhere becomes a major risk. If that wasn't bad enough, entirely new kinds of machines start showing up. Bigger, meaner, and heavily armed. Like the Sawtooth? Yeah, ten years ago, that one. But every couple of years or so, something worse comes along. Believe me. So what's making it happen? Well, no one knows. And the machines... Well, they aren't telling. Who are the Oseram? Well, that's my tribe, far to the northwest. We're good at three things. Arguing, working steel, and brewing. And freebooters. What are those? I guess you could say we were mercenaries. You know, warriors for pay. Except a lot more loyal than that makes us sound. Avad couldn't have taken down his father without our metal and muscle. And now, some of us serve proudly as his personal vanguard. If the Karja have such a cruel history, how did you end up serving them? The last king and his men were butchers. But the new king wants peace. There's nothing cruel about that. Besides, the Karja don't just fight, they build. Well, take Meridian. Next to it, everything else is just a bunch of sticks and stones. Just how big is Meridian? What's it like? Where do I even start? My tribesmen are masters of the forge, the best tinkers in the world. But when it comes to building, the Karja have us beat. The city soars over a canyon with more bridges than the Nora have roads and buildings tall as mountains. And across the valley stands the spire, like a blade thrust into the sky reflecting the sun. You really owe it yourself to see it. So consider that a challenge. Or an invitation. Tell me about the deranged. Well, the way I went up, so it but then now, a few more, if that wasn't. Like the salt. Yeah. So I don't know. I want to ask. Ask away. I should make my way to the blessing. Yeah. Look, maybe I shouldn't say this, but <laughs> it's obvious that you don't belong in this backwater. I mean, you're smart. You're obviously capable. And, well, I mean, look at you. Uh, what are you talking about? You know what. All right, if you ever visit Meridian, look me up. I'll show you around, make introductions. It'll be a whole new life if you want it. Anyway, I have to go to that blessing thing, too. So, uh, see you around, maybe? I know sure our taste has gone too far this time. Inviting you to lot first of Karja into our lanes. Perhaps the Karja have come to make amends. I won't deny them the chance. I won't let the Karja Faithless stop me from enjoying the festival. What harm can they do now? How am I supposed to enjoy myself with those bloodthirsty Karja Faithless hanging about, profaning the land? Perhaps the Karja have come to make amends. I won't deny them the chance. Did you see those Karja
Hi again, Michael. Oh, sorry, I didn't see that. I was uh, dancing naked around the fire last year. I was doing that bit. <clears throat> oh my god. No! Save me! Let's start the Wee! All the are in place. I'm in place. Wee! <laughs> Aloy. Your place right there. The Pearl Mountain is yours. I made it for you. Blasphemy. Sisters. Aspirants, before each of you sits a prayer lantern crafted by your mother. In her honor, light its flame. This is for me, for all I did to make it here, and the answers I'll get after I win the proving. All oh, mother, hear our prayer! What is the child but a mother's hope that takes flight? A glowing flame that climbs the air, set free to the wind, sailing the sky till it fades and falls. So. From one to another passes the chain of love. I won't let the courage of people to stop me from There's the Owen. Festival. I have some questions for him. to judge the Karja, not me. The past should be left in the past. Hello, Owen. You know my name. Ah. Why did you act so strange when we... Must be this festival. I'm really not one for crowds. Stop dodging my questions. All right, cool your fire. I've never seen anyone else with a focus. Where exactly did you find it? In a ruin, north of the claim. That's our name for the Asaram homeland. Up there, the metal seams run deep. Steel giants half buried in loose soil. Forgotten caves that the old ones bored into mountain rock. Your eyes just lit up. I found my focus in a cave just like you're describing. A ruin of the old ones. If you've delved yourself, you know as much as I do. Go to those places for answers. Not me. When we spoke earlier, you winced, then looked like you were in pain, or frightened. Did your focus show you something? It didn't show me anything. I told you. It malfunctioned. Happens all the time. You're not a very convincing liar. Do you always accuse people you've just met of lying? Only the ones who aren't telling the truth. Fire and spit, girl! I'm a plain hammered man with nothing to hide. You don't believe me, that's your trouble, not mine. What are you doing here, Olin? Why come to Noraland? Eren needed a scout for his expedition, and a second for his drinking, that's all. Someone to stop the Sun Priest getting lost. When all this is over, I'm back to delving ruins, rummaging for scrap, scrounging up trinkets to sell. So you're an explorer? Just another Outlander, girl. A man's gotta make his shards. I just make mine in service to the King's court. That's all. I don't understand. We have this device in common, but you can't wait to stop talking to me. <sighs> I already have all the friends I need, girl. I don't need to bother. I'm used to being shunned by the tribe. I thought you'd be different. It's nothing personal. It really isn't. You should... try to enjoy yourself tonight. Big day tomorrow. 
always best to make every day count. That's <laughs> all this year. So many skills last time. Chuff. What did you say? Find your bed, outcast, and dream of winning the proving. That's the closest you're gonna get. Oh, this is the bed house? With you standing guard? I figured it was the latrine. You're you're very present here. Well, well, look who's come in from the wild. This app. I see you've still got a scar from where that rock I threw hit you. Now that's a cherished memory. You can be a real lard sometimes, boss. Cut it out. You didn't know the words to the blessing, did you? But no one hears your- Aw, you even try to dress like a real Nora. Not that it fools anyone. So this is how it's gonna be with you, is it? This is how it's gonna be with everyone, Outcast. You belong in the wilds, not Mother's heart. And you definitely... The only way you know how to feel strong is to make someone else feel weak. It's not working. <laughs> I've trained all my life. You'll see tomorrow how strong I am. Oh, I've seen plenty. You grew a man's body, kind of. But down deep, you're still a scrawny little brat. You know, Burn! I often think of the day I gave you that scar. It's a cherished memory. Yeah, the look on your face when I knocked that stone out of your hand was pretty entertaining. But I suppose you leave that part of the story out when you tell it, don't you? I branded you that day to mark your shame. All you did that day was make me stronger. Just wait. I'll show you tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, right. This is boring. Time for Boss to get some sleep. You'll be the one surprised tomorrow, outcast. Not me. Oh, are you gonna shut your mouth? Because that would be a surprise. Ha ha ha! Fucking pwned, mate. Pwned. Nice job handling Bost. That should keep him quiet. Till morning, anyway. I don't believe we've met. I'm Aloy. Oh, I know who you are. The competition. The others, they'll finish the proving. Most of them. But win it? That's down to Bost, you, or me. Vala. Nice to meet you, Vala. You're right. I am going to win tomorrow. Never celebrate a victory before it's earned, girl. My mother taught me that. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm gonna get some sleep. I plan to be well rested when I run you into the ground tomorrow. <laughs> Your bunk's right there when you want it. 
Okay. Thanks. So, your first day in Mother's Heart. What do you think? You've never slept in a Nora Lodge before. Not very private. It has... certain charms. Homey enough, once you're accepted. That's the problem. I think you'll find a place here. I do. Get some rest. Ready yourselves! What will it take to get you out of here? It's a grazer! Right, guys. I'm gonna I'm gonna get off the broadcast for a bit. I probably will carry on playing for a little bit though. Um, I'll probably broadcast a bit more tomorrow. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching, and uh, see you guys tomorrow. Thank you very much. <laughs>